Bahar Cartoon TV. Hello friends. Today I am going to tell you another news story and the title of the story is A Poor Farmer. Once upon a time, a rich man used to live in a village. Because of his high status, he was very arrogant. One day, a poor farmer came to the rich man for help. Sir ji, I need your help. What kind of help? My fields were destroyed and I am jobless. My family members are so hungry. I have nothing to feed them. So how can I help you? Sir ji, please please lend me some money or give me a job. Hmm. If I give him money, he will not be able to return and my money will turn into bad debt. Hmm. I think I should give him work in my farms. After all, I also need some farmers. After thinking that, rich man told him, "Okay, fine. I will give you work in my field, but I will pay you rupees 200 only. If you agree, then come from tomorrow. Otherwise, you can go from here." I am okay with that, Sid ji. Next morning, he went to the field for work. Now, the rich man used to get all his work done by that farmer. But still, he used to give him only 200 rupees. Take your 200 rupees. Thank you, Sid ji. After some time, the work of fields has been finished. Then, the rich man thought, "Now I don't need that farmer because he has already completed my fields work." I think now I should tell him to go back. After thinking that, he goes straight to the farmer and said, "Take your money and don't come from tomorrow. You have finished my fields work. Now I don't need you." Please, sir ji, don't shut me out of from this. I am a poor man. I don't have money. I need this job. So what shall I do? My farm work is over. Now you take your money. and go from here after saying this he terminated the farmer next morning the farmer sat outside of rich man's house when rich man came outside then he saw that the farmer sat there the rich man asked him what are you doing here i have terminated you please sir ji don't throw me out from this job i really need it hey you get out of my house I don't have any work for you. The rich man got angry with him and thrown him out. But the next day, the farmer again done the same thing. After seeing this, the rich man again asked him, "Hey you, again? What are you doing here?" "Good morning, Sir ji. Only you can give me this job. Please, Sir ji, give me some work." "I already told you." that i don't have any work for you get out of here earlier you were giving me 200 rupees if you want then you can give me only 100 rupees but please give me the job don't you understand go from here and don't come back again but the next day the farmer again sat outside of rich man's house and for some days the same thing happening continuously the rich man became irritated and he thought of an idea to get rid of that farmer this farmer is irritating me a lot i should leave this city for a few days next day the rich man leaves the city before farmer comes he took his family with him and after a few days the rich man came back home with his family he was happy because he did not find the farmer sitting outside his home till few days everything was fine but after some time the rich man thought how it can be possible now he doesn't come here what happened to him uh, did he got any job or something else i have to find out after thinking this the rich man goes to find the poor farmer he asked from other farmers about him have you seen that farmer who was working at my fields no sir I have no idea about him. Yes, we also don't know about him. No, no, sir. 
I also don't know about him. Suddenly, another farmer came there and said, "Yes, sir, I know where is he." Really? If you know, then please tell me. When you were not at your home, that time some thief came into your house. That farmer also sat there by luck. That farmer tried a lot to stop them, and they fought with each other. Because of this, the farmer got injured. That's why he is taking rest at his home. After hearing this, the rich man realized his mistake. He went to meet him and told him, "I am sorry, brother. I did wrong with you. I should not have done that. Take your remaining payment that I haven't given you earlier." Thank you, Sid Ji. So, friends, the moral of this story is that we should treat everyone well. because we never know when that person who we are treating as a liability become a savior if you enjoyed this video do like share and comment and to be the first person to watch our videos make sure to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for timely notifications mahar cartoon tv hello friends today i am going to tell you another news story and the title of the story is a poor farmer once upon a time a rich man used to live in a village because of his high status he was very arrogant one day a poor farmer came to the rich man for help said ji i need your help what kind of help my fields were destroyed and i am jobless my family members are so hungry I have nothing to feed them. So how can I help you? Sethi, please please lend me some money or give me a job. Hmm. If I give him money, he will not be able to return and my money will turn into bad debt. Hmm. I think I should give him work in my farms. After all, I also need some farmers. After thinking that Rich man told him, "Okay, fine. I will give you work in my field, but I will pay you rupees two hundred only. If you agree, then come from tomorrow. Otherwise, you can go from here." I am okay with that, Sid Ji. Next morning, he went to the field for work. Now, the rich man used to get all his work done by that farmer, but still. He used to give him only two hundred rupees. Take your two hundred rupees. Thank you, Sid Ji. After some time, the work of fields has been finished. Then the rich man thought, "Now I." Do